playing into you, Rick. You're a paranormal investigator, not a murderer. Can you shoot yourself? You aren't feeling particularly suicidal at the moment. You're no fun. You're no fun, Rick Jordan. Someone put some real effort into this thing. I don't know. I wouldn't call it effort. I would, <laughs> I would certainly call it effort. Yo. Let's go to the fourth. I don't care. I'm like, going anywhere. What did anyway. you say we needed? We needed dirt. Like... An ambulance of the gods. You see nothing of it. Give me a tree. The tree's bark feels slightly sticky from the dried sap that it's mm. collected on. The tree's. Why can't you take it? I want it. Get it. A large tree. You notice a few holes in the tree's bark where there's some draft. An enormous tree has been. You see nothing of interest around the over. Oh my god, this game. Yeah. Visitor center. Oh, a strange man. I must know you. Maybe evil. he's a shaman. <laughs> There just so happens to be a shaman about. Oh. Hey there, young man. <laughs> it's. Have you ever heard of it's Diglett. Oh. <laughs> Diglett? He has no neck. Oh, well, if you put your finger in front of it, he's just. He is Diglett. He's like this coming out of the ground from his beard. Cool. Did you know that the skunk has been murdering this place? Well, it's about time. Excuse me? Man has been murdering nature for centuries. Of course. It's not surprising that nature has decided to I now understand. Thank you, Ben Jordan. Thank you for showing me the light. Thank you for showing me the light of Jesus that nature is the true cause to salvation. How can I help you? God. How are you how are you doing, sir? Tell me something about yourself. What for? I don't know, I was just being friendly. If it's all the same to you, I'd rather not talk about myself. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Oh, I like this guy. Do you know anything about the skunk ape? Can't say I do. I've never even heard of a skunk ape before. Oh well never mind then. The Moitas. Have you heard about the recent murders? I think I overheard one of the rangers talking about it. But nobody around here tells me anything, since I'm just a receptionist. I'm pretty clueless when it comes to park gossip. That seems a little unfair. Maybe. But if people are getting murdered, I'd rather not know about it. I am happy you being oblivious center? as the well, receptionist. I guess I can tell you more about that display case over there, and the animatronic Mikasuki in the next room. Mikazuki. It's a robot. The animatronic Mikazuki. It's tacky, politically incorrect, and it gives you a blessing if you put in a coin. I see. Anything else? It's broken. Which is probably for the best if you ask me. I'm not asking you. Goodbye. Enjoy your visit. For, I don't get why it growls every time. Because this gun game is watching us, man. It's always watching. Like that bird, that's the skunk ape. You flush the toilet and get a strange satisfaction from doing so. <laughs> what? <laughs> Does it? What is wrong with you, Ben Jordan? Ben Jordan. What is wrong with you? This is a, a In weird... In a bit of kleptomania, you decide to take the whole roll of toilet paper. You never know when it might come in handy after all. No! That was the Sun Games toilet eight paper, you fool!
mystery in here. Just search through the drawers and find a box of diuretic water pills. I'm solving the mysteries, Mark. We got 20 now. We did it. No, I know. I know something. I'll use the the diuretic, and then I'm gonna go to the map. You open up the. I don't care. I'm gonna go to the visitor center, and then I'm gonna get my hand out. I'm gonna go through the door, and then I'm gonna break in there, and I'm gonna shoot everybody, and then I'm gonna like open my inventory. Man. Yeah, we're gonna drug the man, put in his mug. You take the opportunity to slip a water pill into the receptionist's drink when he isn't looking. It quickly dissolves. <laughs> the receptionist takes him. a big gulp from his mug. What does the rest? Oh, yeah. That water went right through me. Excuse me a second, will ya? Oh. Acting casual. Now's my opportunity. The receptionist. Gimme. <laughs> you begin to lift up the glass, but just as you're about to take something from inside. Hey, please don't touch the display case. Oh. Sorry. Maybe it's a timed Darn. challenge. Have some more diuretic pills. I'm gonna sabotage the Shut up, Jeb. Gwen Jordan. And we have to put the toilet paper in it? I don't know. The fog it. Childish delight, you toss the entire roll of toilet paper into the toilet bowl. <laughs> Man, Jordan, I hate you. How I leave? I don't think you can. Oh, yes, you can. Oh, I always had to break the fourth wall. Oh my god, this, this takes a fun. I am giving shame on him. Just take, take the, just take the diuretic pills and take your stupid drink and, and be like, whoa, and then you just get the fuck out of here. I see you do it because I don't even know the controls. Just go over and interact with it. I would like pick it up. I got you now, stupid receptionist. You begin to lift. <gasps> what? Hey. Well, Are you for real? Did that have no effect? <laughs> well, I think. I think. I know how it somehow. I think I know what happened. Uh, I think it's gonna be so stupid if it does. Flush the toilet. Oh dear! It seems that you're throwing the toilet paper into. So I had to freaking do it. it. Doesn't matter that he flushed it. I had to flush it. Okay, sure, sure, Van Jordan, sure, sure. Oh my gosh. Unlimited pills. Sky, <laughs> <laughs> not like overdosed by now. <laughs> no, no, no. That's how you win. He's going to pass out. Excuse me a second. You know, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> he just explodes. What <laughs> diuretic pills? <laughs> oh, I don't believe this. The toilet is broken. I have to find some place to pee. Lightning Sweet Larry, they once called me. Reduced to this. Thank goodness for that tree over there. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Here I go, I'm gonna be the shit of you. <laughs> hey! Just what in the name of guy do you think you're doing? Ah, uh, well, the bathroom is working, so I thought I, I just. Drown this poor tree in your vile waste product? How would you like it if someone decided to relieve themselves <laughs> on you? Oh no, he's oh, just doing this. Yes, I wouldn't. Of course you would. That's why I'm gonna do it. you think it's okay just because it's a tree? Well, I mean, it's not like... You tree definitely you. needs you when the tree oh, comes to life, grabs him, and pulls him away. The I've got some well. information for you, study boy. The man proceeds to yell at the poor receptionist. It looks as though he fears for his life. This could go on for quite some time. Good job, Ben Jordan. 
Another case solved, thanks to diarrhea.